guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Sarah Ray Vargas, in case you didn't know. And today I have a really great video for you. It's great because I think it's great because we have, there's some things that transpired and there's been some history with this particular video. And I am very excited to be here wearing what I'm wearing and that, that's, that's, that's all I had to say about that. So like I said, I have a history with fashion to figure which is who we are featuring today. Um, you guys might have remembered me constantly wearing their stuff forever and ever and ever and ever and ever since like 2013. Um, they were just my jam for a very long time. And then they kind of disappeared for a minute and then they came back and it was kind of like, excuse me? <laughs> and then they really came back and now I'm like, oh, hi friend, I remember you. So um, I am excited to show you guys all of their different denim. I wanted to give you a really good like, in-depth kind of a review of it because when I first started shopping fashion figure in like like I said 2013 14 or so um, I was really not a fan of their denim and I told them that <laughs> um, and I was like you know what it's just not for me and that's okay there are certain brands that I just don't like their jeans and I'm sure you guys can relate there are certain brands that just it's so hard to find denim that works but I will say over the years they have definitely perfected their denim line and um, these last two to three years I would say especially the last two years I well about two years ago I really fell in love with a lot of their jeans they're in my closet I wear them on a regular basis um, so I'm excited to bring this video to you it will be an in-depth sort of like review of a bunch of the items I will also have a bunch of tops that I'll be showing you everything will be linked down below and when I say everything I mean everything and fashion figure partnered with me on this video so they are sponsoring it which means that I get to give you a discount code now you have to use this discount code by March 3rd because that's when it expires but it's a great code because they are having a friends and family sale that just started and my code works on top of that so um, you can't use it on the sale red line which I believe is like the final clearance but the other stuff you can use this code on top of it it's gonna be written on the screen but the code is actually a number and it's 107186 and it will get you an additional 10% off so like I said every single pair of pants and probably like every inseam is going to be listed down below but without further ado let's jump into this um, because we have a lot to cover um, so the top that I have on it's not a bodysuit so kind of looks like one but I just have it tucked in this is in a size one all of the denim that I'm showing you is in a size 16. Fashion to Figure is a plus size brand. I believe the denim is in sizes 12 to 24. Um, if I'm wrong, I'll write it across the screen. I'm wrong. Um, but <laughs> I believe it's 12 to 24. And since Fashion to Figure is a plus size brand, they have plus size sizing. So, for instance, when I shop at like Express or Abercrombie, not Abercrombie, they don't have denim in my size, um, American Eagle, or like Old Navy, I wear a size 18 pretty much all the time. But if I shop at like Link Bryant or like Torrid or pretty much any real deal like plus size brand, I wear size 16. So um, I wear size 16 at Fashion to Figure and I would say it runs pretty true to size. I know you guys are constantly asking my measurements and I will give them to you right now. This area, <laughs> what do you call this, the hip? Um, I measured it right before the video and yeah, I've been on a little incline and then a little decline lately so my numbers are all over the place but this was 53 inches, 53 inches and then this area here was uh, 36 inches so if you want some reference. Um, anyway, these are the mid-rise destructed skinny jeans. I have them in a size short, I'm sorry, in an inseam short. They do have inseams in a lot of their denim, which is great. So the short ones are a 28 inch inseam, the regular are a 31 inch, and the long are a 33 inch. So inseams in plus size denim, you don't always see it, but it's nice when you do. Anyway, um, they fit me just a tiny bit big. I do like how they make my butt look juicy booty. Okay, I like how they make my butt look. They just have a tiny bit of a gap here. Um, you know, I like them though overall. I don't mind it. And like I said, I got the short inseam, so they hit me right at the ankle. Sometimes I cuff these ones, like the shorter ones, because um, when I wear like a short jean, hello package, <laughs> he, he just arrived. <laughs> Alright, I've been waiting on that package for a while. Um, anyway, but when I cuff them, it makes them like short, short, like ankle length, ankle length, which I like. Anyways, they are very stretchy. They have functioning pockets, a recurring theme because I'm constantly telling them and anyone else, you need functioning pockets 
my things are not fake, your pockets should not be fake, okay? Oh, this is a medium wash, FYI, in case you didn't get that. Medium to light wash is kind of my money spot, um, but I'm, I have lots to show you in different washes. Before I forget to tell you that code that I mentioned that I believe it's 107, 186, I was gonna try to like make a whole rap about it, you know what I mean, like Mike Jones style, but uh, it just didn't come to me yet. But anyway, not only can you use it on FTF.com, but you can also use it in store at Fashion of Figure if you have one. Um, I'm thinking of making a trip to one that we have out here. They have a couple in Chicagoland and I haven't been there, so I'd like to take a little peek -see. But anyway, you can use it in store if you're in an area that um, they actually have a retail location in, which is nice. So these next ones, again, all the tops are gonna be from Fashion to Figure 2. They're all in a size one. Um, this is actually a full length like shirt. I do like their graphic tees, they're super soft, they're lightweight, I wear them a lot in the summertime especially. Um, this one has some detailing in the back. Anyway, these are the, uh, oh crap, what are they called? <laughs> okay, these are the premium mid-rise skinnies and these have one of my favorite things that you can possibly ever put into denim, Lycra. I didn't discover Lycra in denim until about two years ago and then I was like, oh my gosh, poof, mind blown. They're the best thing ever because it helps the jeans like retain their shape. I'm someone who doesn't wash my jeans every single time that I wear them. I don't know how often you wear yours before you wash them, but I wear mine a good like three to five times, um, especially because I'm not someone that wears them all day. <laughs> no, I wear them for like two hours a day, five if I'm having a bad day. Um, but otherwise, I don't wear my jeans the entire day. But these ones have life in them, so they're gonna be really good at shaping, like a good like butt shape is happening here. There's no gap on the back for this one with me. Again, they're like an ankle length, and they just, they're very, they're really stretchy, but without being like, I don't know how to explain it. Sometimes they're overly stretchy, and what happens with me is that my butt doesn't get this little like cuff right here because it's so stretchy that it's pulling against it and like the bottom of my butt cheek is lost. Anyway, another thing that I like about these ones in particular, they do come in different washes, but with the type of wash that they have here on the front, it really helps to disguise that belly line, which I know a lot of you guys do not like to show. So just a great pair of jeans with, let's say it together, functioning pockets, okay? I would wager to say that these ones actually fit me better than the last pair, and I think it's because of the Lycra. Um, and if you're in between sizes, you probably would size down in these ones, not up. They have a really good stretch in them, and like I said, they're gonna retain their shape all day, which is nice for people who, I mean, raise your hand if you don't wash your jeans every single time you wear them. <laughs> or your hoodies, or your everything. I mean, my drawers, I wash my drawers. Even if I look at them too long, I'm like, you know what? You're dirty now, you need to go into the washer. Hold up though, I know a lot of you guys are like, how come she didn't mention prices? Because whenever I don't mention a price, you think it's because the price is like wicked high. Um, it's not, the last ones were $49.95. I think these ones were about that same price. And like I said, they're having the friends and family sale, so they're gonna be on sale. And then you can use that code and you can get the extra amount off the sale. So, they're pretty good price. I forgot to mention they have the double button. I love the double button. The triple button is the real OG, but like the double button, he's good too. All right, so jeans like this, this like, dye, wash, whatever, are hands down my least favorite ever, okay? But if it blows your boat and it strokes your goat, my friend, great. I just had to get that off my chest. Um, so these ones have detail on the top, which, guys, I've been using that Dove Clear Skin like deodorant, and it's just, it's not working that well. Don't look at my armpit. So these have the lace up on the side. They have three buns going up the front here. They are like, a, they're just like a regular length. I don't believe this one comes in inseams. And it has some stretch, but not as much. It doesn't feel as stretchy as the first two pairs that I showed you. And it, if it's not clear on camera, these are definitely a more snug fit. You can see that it really pulls in here in my waist and then pa pow, like you have the rest of me. I do think they look good from behind. They're pretty dark, so I'm not sure how well you can see it. They look pretty good from behind, um, but like I said, they're not my favorite. They are a high rise though, so they have like a 12 and a half inch rise from like crotch to, you know, tip here. <laughs> yeah. Now when you guys like or don't like something about a particular item, not necessarily just how it looks on me, but when you're looking for it and you know what you're looking for in denim or in jackets or in shoes or whatever, it's really great for you guys to tell me in the comment section because a lot of these companies, these brands, these retailers, 
they're watching, right? Like literally watching the videos and they want to know what not only my opinion is, but your opinion too, especially as a consumer. So tell me what you think. Do you like a high rise? Do you like a mid rise? Do you like an ultra high rise? low bra kind of rise <laughs> like tell me what you like and what you want to see in the comments and you have no idea how many of these companies reach out to me after I do a video or whatever they want our opinion they want to send stuff so that I can show it so that we can gauge what people actually think about it so that next time they release something they can come correct I mean, Style Logic hasn't reached out, but I think there's no saving that particular one. La 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 la, wait till they get my denim right. Oh, okay. JK, um, so these are an ultra high rise jean. Um, what was I gonna say? If you guys wanna see like a denim guide to all stores that you can possibly think of that have a regular sort of denim collection, feel free to let me know. This is definitely something I can continue to provide to you from whatever store you wanna see it from and it can be a good reference guide because you guys are constantly asking me about denim or you're asking me to please go and try this one pair of jeans and I'm like, one pair of jeans does not a video make. But anyway, if this is something you'd like to see from other retailers too, feel free to let me know down in the comments. I would be happy to oblige. I have a few in mind. Um, but anyway, I digress. So these are the ultra high rise. So from crotch to tip here, we have a 14 inch rise, my friends. This is a high, high rise. I love these. This looks super good. Like for me, I love wearing a crop top or something with these because so much of my stomach is covered. Like a crop top will actually a lot of times fall uh, further down than the actual waistband of this denim. Um, but I have a bodysuit on right now. Looks really good with bodysuits. A lot of you guys ask how to wear them. Man, the higher the jean, the better you are. <laughs> this looks like a medium wash. They have functioning pockets. Thank you. I think my butt looks pretty good. Um, that's like a big concern for me because I'm not super satisfied with my butt if I'm just being honest here There are certain pairs of jeans that can really elevate my booty and that's one of my main concerns These ones fit really nicely at the waist I would say they're actually even a little bit on the looser side in the legs So if you're in between you could possibly size down unless your waist is a little bit on the bigger side because the waist fits me like Perfectly perfectly. There's no gap. There's no anything happening back here functioning pockets front and back Everywhere. Yeah, we hear you. Okay. They're listening. Yes, we want real pockets These are like a regular length. So just a tad bit long for me actually a little bit loose at the bottom for me But um, these ones I will very likely have them hemmed um, just because I really really like the actual fit of these for me when I go to tailor my clothes and some of you suggested that I start a series called Sarah sews it you don't want to see me tailor my own clothes but I kind of actually I, I think that would be a good idea um, but otherwise I usually just take it to the dry cleaner and it's 15 bucks 10 to 15 bucks usually uh, for a pair of jeans so if it's worth it to you just know that that's probably a resource that you have very close to you if you don't know of a tailor which I don't <laughs> these pants I didn't think they were for me. I tried some pants on like this, but they had like a little more jazz to them uh, recently. And I was shocked by the fact that I even liked them because there are certain trends that I feel like are just designed for a skinny body, frankly. <laughs> I just don't think they're meant for my body. Um, but this one, I love. I just, I didn't think like bringing more attention to my waist was really gonna be I don't know, you know, more bulk in this area was really going to flatter me. But these pants are super comfortable. So these are like the paper bag kind of pants. They have like no restriction in them because the top is actually, it has elastic in it. It does have buttons and um, a zipper. However, it has elastic in the front and back, or maybe it's just, in the, I don't know, but it stretches basically. And then <laughs> hello functioning pockets. It doesn't have any pockets on the back. So um, it's a really cute jean. This one is not available in inseams, I believe. And a regular inseam fits me just, like I said before, like one or two inches too long. I mean, I can make it work, but like in an ideal world, it'd be a little bit shorter for me. 
The fact that the pockets are, I don't, I don't even know how to describe it. They're a little different than what you would typically find in a pair of jeans. They're not like from the top, they're from the side. It helps disguise like this sort of area, like, you know, many of us try to do. They're super duper comfortable. I mean, I'm not gonna like be crazy and act like they're sweatpants, but they have virtually no restriction in them. This is probably not a pair that I would wear like five times without washing. I could see them being a little loosey-goosey after maybe two to three times. Um, but overall, they're dumb comfortable. So these are the two-tone destructed skinny jeans. They're meant to be like an ankle length. I'm a little on the short end. Um, these are a great pair of jeans. So on the right leg, I have them just down the way they are supposed to be, basically the way they came. And then on the left leg, I cuff them and the bottom is like a deep, like navy kind of blue. So you see the little cuff. I kind of like the cuff, I don't mind the other color. Um, you could also cuff them in if you didn't want that navy color on there or again hem them if you're short like me i'm actually not that short i'm 5'4 which i believe is the average height of an american woman so i'm done with people calling me short i'm just kidding i'm not offended by that they are a mid rise and they're a little bit further down in the back which i kind of like i like i said a mid rise is really good um every day like for me i'm like an everyday mid rise kind of girl special occasions being cute, crop tops, whatever. I'm a high rise, ultra high rise kind of girl. I am never a low rise kind of girl. That's not me. But a mid rise is like my good everyday kind of jean. These are really cute. These are one of the more expensive pairs of jean that I showed you. Um, and they are $54.95. So it's really not bad. The prices are pretty good. So I will say before I jumped back into bed with fashion to figure, okay, yes, we run a little hiatus. But you know, if Cardi and Offset can make it, we can make it too. Um, I did privately kind of, you know, do my own thing and order a bunch of stuff and try it out. Took some of it on vacation. I wanted to wear it around when I knew I was gonna see people, no one was gonna ask me anything. <laughs> like so, um, I did try a lot of their stuff out. I just wanted to make sure there was still the same brand that I like knew and loved all those years um, before you know everything kind of switched for them. And I'm I'm excited to tell you guys like I I'm still genuinely so in love with these clothes and I missed having this like retailer basically in my life like in my Rolodex of people that I can shop from so I'm excited I have a couple more to show you though so let's keep it moving guys let me tell you a little something about jeggings like this I hate them okay <laughs> um a couple years ago maybe two years ago fashion and figure sent me some of their jeggings and they were like similar to this and I remember being like so angry, even trying to get them on. They didn't fit right. I didn't like how they sat on my body. I gave them to my friend. My friend gave them to her grandma and her grandma looked amazing. I was a little nervous when I saw that they put these in my package and I was like, hey, I can say like mean stuff about your clothes, right? And they were like, say what you want to say. So I don't even have anything negative to say about these freaking jeans. I don't know what they did, but they fixed the damn problem, okay? So these jeggings are the bomb. They have a three inch waistband up here and they're hella stretchy. It's kind of like you're wearing like Spanx but without like the attitude problem that it gives you. Um, the pockets are functional. All of the pockets and all of the denim that I've shown you guys are, it's freaking functional, okay? It's amazing. Um, anyway, these feel very much like my leggings that I wear on a regular basis. Um, they are not the best looking on my butt. They're not bad but they're not the best. Well, I guess I kind of look like I have a little cheek, right? A little cheek, I got a little cheek. These jeans do come in different washes. I believe they have like a dark, a black, and then like a medium wash. They do have some like lighter washes coming out, I believe. Uh, so keep your eyes peeled for that. These do have inseams, some of them have inseams. Um, so this hits me at like a beautiful place. It's, this feels like from here down, it feels like jeans that I wear all the time. They're comfortable, they have some kind of like restriction to them, but not overly so. Like I could wear them all day and be totally fine. Up here, you know, there's no buttons or anything. So it's just, it's just more comfortable really. There's no gapping either because it's so fitted, you know, around the waist, but not to the point where it's tight. I'm telling you those other ones, I almost like wanted to cry. I was so frustrated trying to put them on and like them. <laughs> and I was like, it's not possible. And I'm whipping them across the room. I'm not gonna try these on because I feel like this video has gotta be 42 minutes by now. But they also have them in like a dark uh, black wash, a black wash. And then they have them in like a darker wash as well. And these are some of the 
least expensive uh, options that I showed you guys today. So I believe these ones are $44.95 regular price. And then obviously discounts on top of that. And I think last but not least, again, another little FTF uh, top here. But these are the everyday like mid-rise skinny jeans. These are just kind of their basic jeans. These ones again, I believe are at the same price point as the jegging. So a little bit less than some of the other ones that I showed you. Um, these are pretty basic. I don't love how low it is in the back. Like I feel like this is a little bit lower than some of the other ones, um, even the other mid-rise ones. These ones fit fine. They're not my favorite, if I'm just being honest. <laughs> um, they fit fine, they're comfortable, but um, they don't have, I don't know, they're not quite as like, they don't feel as good as the other jeans, basically. I don't necessarily love the actual makeup of the denim as much, um, but I will say, <laughs> As far as length goes, these are some of the best ones, and I like how uh, skinny the ankle is, so you never know. If I could just like piece some of the stuff together, I can make like the ultimate jean. All right, guys, that is all that I have for you. Yes, I have a different pair of jeans on again. I just had to show you these ones, because like they say the sun sun back there. Ooh, you should get jeans and like put your man's name on it, like your husband. Maybe not your boyfriend, because you just never know. But your husband? Hmm? Your dog? Whatever you want. Um, I did want to show you guys these though. How cute, right? They do have a lot of different denim with like different distressing and they have a bunch of stuff that comes out all the time, whatever. They have a bazillion items on the website, but I love that these ones have the distressing in the front and in the back of the leg. Anyway, that is all that I have for you guys. I hope that you've enjoyed this video, this like ultimate denim guide to fashion a figure. <laughs> Hello, possible title name. If you guys want to see more stuff like this, if you want to see denim guides to different stores, or if you want me to feature different stuff from fashion to figure, you know I was always rocking like their dresses, their swimwear, all their stuff. If you want to see more from them, let me know, give me a thumbs up, and like I said, if you want to get any of these on the website or in store, um, you know, whatever they have in store, you can use that code, but it does expire on March 3rd, so I'm trying to get this video up ASAP because you can use my code for an additional 10% off on top of the sale prices, but that is excluding that like red mark line, line, mark, like the clearance, clearance stuff. Um, yeah, it excludes that. But they do have their friends and family sale going on right now and it's going on for a couple days. And that code is 107186 and that will get you that additional 10% off on top of uh, the sale that they have going on right now, which is a pretty good deal. A lot of these jeans will be very inexpensive if you um, combine those two things. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. I was trying to be as transparent as possible. <laughs> Obviously, I'm not gonna like every single pair of someone's denim. Even these ones, as cute as they are, they're a little low for me too. Um, but I mean, they have my name on them, so oh, I kinda gotta love them. But um, anyway, I do hope that you enjoyed the video. I hope you're having an amazing day, and I will see you in my next one. All of this will be linked down below. Rest assured, all the denim was 16, all the tops were a size one. Just gotta reiterate that, because people will ask. So. Anyway, have a great day. Peace out.